Hi, I'm Dr. Greg McDonald. We're going to talk a little bit about animal care today, uh, and I wanted to talk a little bit about uh, urinary tract infections in dogs. They're more common in females, and what the owners might notice is that the animal is urinating more frequently with less volume, and uh, sometimes with intense urgency. If your dog's running around and squatting and squatting and squatting and not very much urine is coming out, there's a good chance that you have a urinary tract infection. Because of the anatomy of the dog, the female dogs get them more frequently, uh, and so uh, it's very, very important to pay attention. I always like to tell my owners that it's important to pay attention to uh, food intake, water intake, water outflow, and uh, poop uh, coming out of the animal as far as knowing if your dog is healthy or not. Uh, one of the things that your veterinarian is going to want to know to help you make the diagnosis is to get a urinary tract uh, a specimen, and so bringing a little bit of urine into your dog, uh, dog's doctor will help them make a diagnosis of uh, urinary tract infection. Again, this is one of the things that we like to use for the female dogs because, again, the, when they're squatting, they can, uh, you can scoop this underneath them and catch a little urine, and you really only need about that much urine to go in there, and that way you can bring that to your veterinarian. It should be brought to your veterinarian fairly quickly. If you collect it at night, put it in the refrigerator, bring it to your veterinarian first thing in the morning. Uh, the other thing uh, that your veterinarian is going to want to do once you make the diagnosis of a urinary tract infection is possibly change your pet's diet. Um, dogs should be put on something like CD, again, based on the uh, urinary tract uh, infection. Uh, if there are some stones in, the, in there or the pH is too high, your veterinarian may want a special diet to prevent that from happening again. This is a diet that's made by Hills, and it's called CD. It helps to control stones and uh, urinary tract infections in dogs. Uh, also, your uh, veterinarian is going to probably want to put your dog on some antibiotics, and there are several ones that we like. Uh, Cephalexin is one that's really popular. Uh, another one that's really popular now is a product called Batril because it has a very wide spectrum and it gets most of the bacteria that is in the bladder. Also, your veterinarian may want to do an x-ray if in the urinary uh, specimen you bring in they, f they see high levels of crystals. Uh, there's a possibility that your dog has uh, stones, and bladder stones in the bladder is common, and we have to dis uh, distinguish between whether your dog has a urinary tract infection or bladder stones.